This way, yeah. Well, you look nice and fresh and green. There's the parking lot scene, just to get that in perspective. There's Mark right there uh, by the flag. See him? There's Mark right there. There goes Mark. Third guy in, getting in step. There's the Navy guys forming up over there. Well, here's what the empty stadium looks like. We'll be getting a few views of this when it fills up. It looks like the Navy side over there. Opposite side to my right is the Army side. What the heck are those guys doing there? I guess some band set up stuff. That's where we are, guys. One coming in. Tell us where you are, Mark. See him? We don't even know what rank he's in, huh? You know what squad he's in? The regimental command sergeant major is Cadet Command Sergeant Major Brian McLean. That's Brian Ducote there in front of the 3rd Regiment. If that's the 3rd Regiment group, I think that's the 3rd Regiment just the fourth regiment, finishing coming in. Is commanded by Cadet Captain Edmund Lathitis III from Wausau, There's Wisconsin. There's the whole corps. The whole corps the except for a couple hundred guys Cadet in the stadium Jason there. Stoneman. Salem, Oregon. Company A is commanded by Cadet Captain Richard Thomas from Chicago, Illinois. Join the Corps and cheer the Army Team towards Guy's ready to go in the black and gold here. Got his all his body painted, his face painted. He's got a long way to go. Hey, which one are you, Mark? Tell us. Here comes the, is that a C-140, 140, 140, 140. 
Here's the plane that's coming around to drop the skydivers into the bowl. And here comes the Navy, uh, the Navy guy. He's dropping out of that helicopter there, or that balloon. Okay, here's what the stadium looks like when it's full. Almost full. There are a lot of empty seats to be a sellout. Well, it's still got 30 minutes of game time. Our representatives of Navy's 13th company, commanded by Midshipman First Class Joe Delphi. Ladies and gentlemen, please give a warm welcome. Robert Shaw. They are followed by the midshipmen and cadets who are spending the first semester of their second class year at the Sister Academy. These students are all at the very top of their class and it is a great honor to be selected as an ambassador of your school. But inevitably, each midshipman and cadet eagerly awaits the big game for the chance to acquire bragging rights. These midshipmen and cadets will now join their respective academies and sit with their classmates to help cheer their team on to victory. Give them the resolve to do their very best and protect them from injury and harm. We realize that this sporting event is not simply a game. It requires mental alertness, leadership, and team spirit. Bless both teams as they face one another in competition now, and the Army-Navy team around the world as they join together in ensuring the freedoms we enjoy as a people. God sensitized the people of our nation to the wonderful qualities of these midshipmen and cadets. Inspire us all by their honor, commitment, and courage. May their performance on the field and off the field be a source of pride and encouragement for all of us. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, Please remain standing. The parts we watched were so gallantly streaming, and the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night. Here These are Navy SEALs, we heard. They're all going to come in this time. <laughs> the two best demonstration teams in the world, the United States Army Golden Knights and the United States Navy Parachute Team Millie Frog. Following the stadium on our first half ground from Fort Lake, Florida, with over 5,000 jumps.